Mary Charlotte, and if you're a subscriber, welcome back to my channel. I still have mono, so that's why my voice is like kind of raspy. My throat is really sore. But I wanted to do a video for you all today all about my top 10 college essentials. So I gathered up and I brainstormed with my sweet mates about like what everyone thinks like the college essentials are. I'm going to be sharing with you all what I think are the most essential things for a college student to have every like all of my lifeline products. So without further ado, let's get started. The first one was really easy and that's Febreze. This, nothing in this video is sponsored by the way. Everything is just me telling you all like you're gonna want this. Uh, Febreze, this is um, linen and sky. Go for whatever fragrance you prefer, but this is such an essential. Oftentimes, there are just ominous odors that go through my room, my sumate's room, the bathroom, the whole suite. So this is totally something that you're gonna wanna have. Like just, you know, it's just like an essential. It just makes everything smell like fresh laundry. So definitely get this. Speaking of laundry, you're definitely also going to want something to do your laundry with. So my recommendation is Tide Pods. Definitely recommend just getting some sort of pod detergent because it's so much easier to just go down to the laundry room and pop one of these in the little um, thing than try to measure out how much you're supposed to use. This just makes it so much easier and I just throw this in my laundry bag, take it down there, pop one in, and you're good to go. So. This just makes it so much easier and they last you a really long time. Yeah, they're just super easy and convenient and make laundry not so stressful. So definitely recommend getting some sort of like pod detergent. Um, it doesn't have to be Tide, but just like any kind of little like thing you pop in. It's just so much easier. So on my list is a good comfy sweatshirt that just fits you really well like you just need to have some sort of good comfy sweatshirt to keep in your bag so that if you're studying in the library or like the student center or if you're in class and you get cold you have this to throw on so this is the one I keep with me it's just like a Kappa UGA sweatshirt that we got um, for initiation but just some sort of comfortable sweatshirt is so important this one's pretty simple just some sort of really comfy sweatshirt to keep in your bag um, people are always like, does anyone have a jacket? Does anyone? I'm so cold because they do keep it pretty cold inside the building. So if you're in class or you're studying or you're in the dining hall and you're cold, it's just good to have on hand like a good jacket, especially even if it's hot outside. Like here it's October and it's still like pretty warm during the daytime. Um, and I get cold in classrooms and stuff. So I always like to keep a jacket with me and I just recommend a comfy sweatshirt because Everyone dresses pretty casual here. So next up are some good walking shoes. I take the bus to some and then I'll walk home or vice versa. So um, I definitely recommend having some good walking shoes. These are my Adidas Superstars. I feel like they go with like all of my outfits but then they don't look too athletic. Like they're just kind of like casual. This or like some Converse or just something that's comfortable to walk in is super important. You don't want to be like walking miles across campus in like flip flops or something because that's just not going to be very comfortable. So definitely recommend some good walking shoes. My next recommendation is like basically this specific towel. Ikea, they sell a bunch of towels in a bunch of different colors um, and the style of the Ikea towels is so ideal for college. Jenna, my roommate, and I both got our towels from Ikea because they have these hooks on them already for you. It's so lovely. Um, I have gray and Jenna has black, but it's just so nice to have the hooks already on your towel for you because I know a lot of the times like if you hang a towel and then it'll like fall off, I don't know. Um, we use command hooks and we hang these up. That's more of like a dorm essential than a college essential like command hooks, but another like side note essential, command hooks. But um, we just hang these off of our command hooks and they just always hang so nicely you never have to worry about them falling off because literally they have a like little loop on there for you. They're not too expensive and they have this loop on here. It's just so convenient you guys. Definitely recommend. Essential number six is hand sanitizer. This is one of the old Bath and Body Works ones that I haven't used all the way up yet. Hand sanitizer is important at any education level, whether it be elementary school, middle school, high school, college, grad school, who knows? It's very important to have hand sanitizer with you at all times. Everyone here gets sick, you guys. Everyone. It's gross. Literally, if one person gets sick, everyone gets sick. It's just like the dorm plague. Like, I'm not even kidding. It's the worst. Next essential is a good water bottle. So, no matter what kind of water bottle you like, use that. Um, it's important to stay hydrated and healthy. Like I said, everyone gets sick, so staying hydrated is 
one way to stay healthy. My favorite types of water bottles are these Camelback ones. I just drink the most water when I use these. So I have one of these that just says University of Georgia, but literally just get whatever kind of water bottle you want. Yeah, just get a water bottle because you definitely want to stay hydrated and it's important to have water in like all your classes in case you get thirsty. I don't know, it's just, it's just good to have water people. Like I definitely recommend keeping water with you. Number eight is the most essential in this whole video. Like I'm very happy that you stuck around until this because this is some serious insight, okay? This is your best friend, you guys. I did not have one of these before coming to college. I got here within the first week I went and bought one. Like you need one of these. A Mophie case or a Mophie battery pack. Um, you need this. I'm not even joking. Like, I know they're expensive, but seriously buy one. I'm not kidding. Mophie battery pack. You get a case or, like, just any kind of, like, external battery. Your phone is always dying. Always, always dying. Literally, I'll get to, like, 10 a.m. and my phone will be on 50%. Like, how does that even happen? I don't even know. I don't even wake up until 9. If this one works is that you open up this little thing and you have the charger and then you have the USB. So this is how you charge the charger and then... This is how you charge your phone. So um, it's just super handy, super portable, saves my life all the time. It charges your phone like uh, from zero to 100 three times when it's fully charged. So this just comes in so handy, I'm telling you guys. Number nine is a good pair of headphones. So these are my Beats. Um, they're a little rose gold wireless Beats and I love them, you guys. They're so amazing, I use them like every day. They're fully charged, they last 10 hours. And um, if you just like charge them overnight, they'll go from dead to fully charged. So then it lasts for literally like a week. Noise canceling. I wear these from walking from class to class, just some music. Um, but also like if you're in your room and you want to watch like a video or something, or watch Netflix, um, or like just work on something and listen to music, these are super nice because you can kind of just zone everything out and just focus on what you're doing. I use these a lot when I'm editing my videos and stuff. So um, I definitely recommend something like this. Just a good pair of headphones that you can rely on all year is so important. Finally, the last, but definitely not least, my final product for you all today is dry shampoo. You definitely are going to want this. Like honestly, a lot of times people here just like forget to shower. Like you're so busy, sometimes you just don't shower, which is kind of gross, I know. But um, if you just haven't washed your hair in a while, dry shampoo, you guys, it's the best. Hair looks so like clean and voluminous and great. So. Dry shampoo is a lifesaver all the time. I use this literally so much. Actually, my hair is like pretty like stick straight and like just boring. And then this just kind of like gives it some like, mm, you know, gives it some texture. It's just great, you guys. I'm telling you, get some dry shampoo. If you're looking for high-end ones, I love this one. It's Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Dry Shampoo. I also love the Dry Bar one. Um, and if you're looking for some drugstore ones, Batiste works amazing. It's t definitely my favorite. Um, but literally, like, any of the ones you try, I'm sure, will work just fine. So, yeah. Anyways, dry shampoo is a definite must at college, and that is my final recommendation for you all. Alright, so that is my top 10 essentials for college students. If you want me to do like a top 10 dorm essentials video or um, like like tips for the dorm or I don't even know because I was kind of thinking like oh that's just a life essential. Like I was trying to differentiate between life essentials, college essentials, student essentials, dorm essentials. So I just tried to try to bring together everything in this video that I was feeling like I've been using all the time and I, like are my lifelines here at college and that I didn't always use before. I hope this video was helpful for you all. Um, leave me a comment down below letting me know what your college essentials are if you're in college or just like your school essentials because I would love to know. Also let me know of any video requests you have for me because I love reading all your video requests and adding them into my schedule for planned videos and stuff. I'm trying to upload every Tuesday and Friday so don't quote me on it but um, that's what I'm trying to do. So um, you can try to look for videos from me on Tuesdays and Fridays. Also leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. I would love to have you join the Beauty is Good fam here. I just make like college and lifestyle, beauty. I don't know, there's some fun videos. So you should subscribe if you're not already. And I think that's it. I'm going to stop rambling. And I will see you in the next video. Bye everyone.